got started in restaurants when I was still in school. First it was uh, washing dishes. After just a couple of weeks, I knew I loved it. And just having the, my background, my father's from Fiji, my grandmother's Chinese and my grandfather's Indian. I, I was quite comfortable with lots of spices and chilies. And before long, I was just catapulted into being a chef. Uh, 2014, I won uh, the Sydney Morning Herald Young Chef of the Year, which is uh, quite a privilege. It's just, there's so many great restaurants opening up in Melbourne. Lots of them are walking distance as well. We're long grain situated on the outskirts of Chinatown. It's a really cool place. There's a couple of awesome restaurants around here and bars. I think we got the method right. I think the way it's just a one-stop shop. You can have some cocktails, you can listen to a DJ, you can have some snacks in the bar, then you can go upstairs or you can just come for a meal or you can just come for drinks. I think the vibe just you know, feeds off that as well. Long grain Sydney two hats now for the last three years. Long Grain Melbourne, we've had one hat for the consecutively since we've opened. Really taking Southeast Asian cuisine but injecting it with amazing produce. So balance is super important. Sweet, sour, salty, spicy is the main aim of the game when we're um, creating the menu and for everything to play off each other. Seafood is really great to steam, mainly for the fact that it's so quick to do. You know, you can steam, we do chicken, we do duck, and we do dim sum and things like that at the restaurant. You can easily do that at home as well. I'm gonna do a whole fish uh, with a beautiful light salad of shallots and chili and ginger, and then a black bean and ginger dressing to go over it. I'm gonna fill up the steamer with about two liters of water. Set the dial to steam. We'll let that heat up, and in the meantime, we'll get our snapper ready. Since we're steaming it, simply run your knife just to make sure scales. You don't want any left over. Score the fish right behind the head, all the way down to the bottom, and this will enable the steam to really penetrate the fish. So all the way. This is about 800 grams. So we'll just come back along the snapper. We call this a pineapple score, and then we'll just repeat on the other side as well. It's very important when you're steaming for the fish to be super fresh because you're not cooking with any fat, you're not flavoring it with anything, it's just the, the beautiful fish. It's ready to roll. Right in the center, pop the lid back on. And this guy should take about eight to 10 minutes to cook. Don't ever be afraid to pop the lid open and see how he's going. So first of all, let's get the salad together. So we're gonna use some beautiful green shallots. Chiffonade these really nice and fine. Peel some ginger. Just need about one knob. Again, really nice and fine. And you could always grate or microplane this into the dressing and that'll mix through the salad and just seep into the fish really beautifully. Next, we're gonna have some chili. I like it quite hot, so these little bird's eyes or scud chilies, I'll put one of them, finely sliced. You can take the seeds out if you don't want it too hot. And then a nice long red chili, and this is great just for the garnish. And then we've got some beautiful coriander. Just pick a whole bunch, just the leaves. So now we'll get started on our dressing. A tablespoon of fish sauce, a tablespoon of sugar, our black beans, rinsed, black vinegar, rice wine vinegar, oyster sauce, plus some of our nice finely chopped ginger. And then we're gonna add about 125 mils of grapeseed oil. In Cooking Asian, I really recommend taste, taste, taste. It should be a little bit hot from the chilies once it's in the salad, a little bit salty, a little bit vinegary. And that's perfect. So now we'll check on our snapper. It's been about eight minutes. Just with a spatula, we'll just check right behind the head and if it's coming off the bone easily, which it is, it's ready. So I'm gonna turn it down to keep warm and then we're gonna serve. I choose to use two small fish slice, gently onto the plate. Perfect. The beautiful black beans and the ginger and get that into the cavity. Decorate the plate a bit as well and use the remainder of the dressing to dress the salad, give it a light toss. And there you have it. That's Long Grain's steamed whole snapper 
with ginger, shallot, and black bean.